So to measure the range of motion of joints, I have my client lay down supine or on her back. I'm gonna use a goniometer to measure the uh, joint range of motion. The first one will be for the shoulders. I'm gonna have my client have her arms straight as she reaches all the way back to her head. All the way back, there you go. So the fulcrum will be at the armpit, measuring at the shaft of the humerus. All right. Next, we'll do elbow flexion. So I have my client have her arms nice and straight. I'll put the fulcrum right face the elbow right here. I'll be moving with the radius as I come up. So she'll come up, excuse me. So coming up. Make sure she goes nice and smooth. All right. Next, we'll measure hip flexion. So I'll find the greater protrator here. Nice and straight. I'll be moving with the arm. She'll have her knee slightly bent or at 90 degrees. She'll be lifting up to her chest, nice and slow. All right. Next, I'll have her in a prone position on her stomach. We'll measure knee flexion, knee range of motion. Putting the full curl right on the out lateral part of the knee. We'll be moving with the tibula. So we'll have her go nice and slow, coming up. Thank you very much.